the last tip is you need to lean into the human side of finance. Women want advisors who are going to notice what they're thinking and feeling about this next stage of life, not just jump into planning. So often people will say to me, okay, Kathleen, you were in the, uh, the counseling profession for 15 years. What the heck does leaning into the human side of finance mean? Well, here are some things you can do. You can notice the language a client is using. As I said earlier, language matters. Is she using thinking words? Is she using feeling words? Match the type of words that she's using. Notice the tone of the conversation. And the beauty of this is you don't have to be right. You don't have to solve her problems or solve her feeling. You just have to get curious about it. So suppose you have that woman who is afraid of being a bag lady. She has an incredible amount of um, assets. There is no way, even if she went on a huge spending binge for years, would she run out of money. But what you need to do when she brings that up is ask her, when does this fear come up? When did it start? When is it better? When is it worse? Do you know anybody else that had this situation in their lives? So it's getting curious. And the way I want you to think about it is put on your behavioral scientist hat. It's not a therapist hat. It's looking at, OK, so someone has a, a money behavior. What are they thinking before, during, and after? And how do I help them if it's an unhealthy behavior? Maybe decrease that behavior. If it's a healthy behavior, how do I help them do more of that? So it's leaning in to the human side of finance.